one useful way to think about neural networks is that we don't we don't program them, we don't make them. We we kind of we grow them. You know, we have these neural network architecture. It's kind of like a scaffold that the circuits grow on. Um, and they sort of, you know, it starts off with some kind of random, you know, random things and, and it grows. And it's almost like the, the objective that we train for is this light. Um, and so we create the scaffold that it grows on and we create the, you know, the light that it grows towards. But the thing that we actually create, it's, it's, it's this almost biological, you know, entity or organism that we're, that we're studying. Um, and so it's very, very different from any kind of regular software engineering. Um, because at the end of the day, we end up with this artifact that can do all these amazing things. It can, you know, write essays and translate and, you know, understand images. It can do all these things that we have no idea how to directly create a computer program to do. And it can do that because we we grew it. We didn't we didn't write it. We didn't create it. And so then that leaves open this question at the end, which is what the hell is going on inside these systems? 